you started to see a fair alignment between you and the client. How do you do this? And the other day when we were, we were having a call, you, you called it total ownership approach. What is this about? Uh, <clears throat> we at Controllers, um, every decision we take, everything that we do is around uh, the total ownership philosophy. Uh, to put it in a nutshell, um, total ownership means meet the client expectations rather than a you know, letter or, or a contract. It involves, uh, it, it posed to the significant challenges over a period of years, uh, which involved uh, uh, us to make significant investments in meeting those expectations to that of uh, changing our, the way we work to changing the um, uh, infrastructure, because uh, a simple example is uh, the client's expectation that I'm bringing my equipment to tier four data centers at that time has to be five nines, even though the infrastructure has a single power source, for example, where we need to, we, we took a decision to invest in, um, you know, to, to uh, put hundreds of STS boxes to uh, ensure that that expectation is delivered, even though we are not contractually obligated. Yet, but, um, Apart from these challenges, it's, it helped us. Probably it's the single biggest contributor for controlless growth of nearly 100% over the last five years. Uh, and the reason why we get uh, so much of repeat business as well as a reference business. Apart from that, when we started out um, in a marketplace crowded by the global majors, Indian, the large brands within India, uh, we said we can only make a difference if, we can only make it happen if, if we come up with a significantly improved as well as differentiated offerings, mm -hmm. which resulted in uh, uh, establishing the country's first tier four data center, which resulted in uh, establishing a data center which has a, a different kind of a size in those times than when we started out, which made us make investments in the network infrastructure automate it completely, come up with uh, a new concepts like a DR on demand, which has become a industry practice today. And uh, put up a number of projects, around 16 projects we currently are doing to ensure that the services are delivered with a consistent quality. Okay. 